Well, hello and welcome back to our Half Hill series in this World of Warcraft gold making. Let's continue. I think we're on day four now. Yeah. So here we are. Uh, we're going to start out each day by harvesting the crops from our previous day. So let's go ahead and get these carrots up. Hope everybody's having a good day. Um, sorry for the delay in the video. Um, the authentication servers for WoW were down after I got off work at 6.30. So I apologize if this is coming to you a little bit late in the States. Um, it might be a little bit delayed if you're also in another country. So I apologize for that. But we're going to get right to it. So, Alright, so let's see what we got next. So we're going to go ahead and talk to Farmer Yoon today, get our dailies done. I should have auto accepted. I don't know why I didn't do that. Okay, so we're going to go slay the Hunter Chief. Some of these quests are going to start to get pretty repetitive because um, they're dailies. And each time they're going to up our rep so that we can go ahead and open up all four plots. Even though my main tune is already exalted, um, I still have to go through the dailies and get the rep on each individual alt so I can open up all the plots though. Um, so we always skip that part to buy more of the commendation badges, but if you're doing this on your first tune, um, you can go ahead and buy those from Gina and I'll show you what I mean. So right here, there is the grand combination of the tillers, but since I already have it on my other one, I can't use it on these ults. But if this is your main tune, you can go ahead and buy that to up your rep with them so that you can buy the higher C packages. You're still going to need to do the dailies and everything that we're doing each and every day so that all your four plots can be open though. But you'll be able to eventually, once you get to, um, where is it? Eventually, once you get to Exalted right now, um, you'll be able to get the bag of the snake root seed, just as what we're after, so that we can plant our minerals every day. And that's where we're going to get our passive gold making income from. So I just want to make sure that was clear so you guys were knowing what we were working on and what we were headed towards. So. I hope everybody understands that, and that should be okay. We'll be good. All right. Um, except they don't even wear them. She's not here. Let's see. <clears throat> chi chi. No chi chi. There hasn't really been too many of them today. Uh, yeah, let's go over here. The river. Nothing there. Okay. So I don't think she has money matters. Nope. Okay. So we're going to go plant our witchberry seeds. And then we'll be doing our other stuff too. I think we have to do three of these, correct? I think so. Yep. Oh, we just have to plant the one. Okay. So now we plant our one witchberry seed. Um, oops, my face is <laughs> the wrong way. All right, there we go. All right, we'll come back in a second. Um, we're gonna go get our dailies done and then we'll come back and we'll take care of that. So same as yesterday, looks like the same ones. The Chief, the Marmots, all that other fun stuff. All right, here we go. And we just dump them. I have other alts on this account that I'm also opening up their farms. So I think this is about the fourth time that I've done this quest today. And it's just like, oof, I cannot wait till all the plots are opened. And then we can just go every day, harvest and replant, harvest and replant. It is taking me a little bit of time, you know, right now to get through all these. Um, so I'm taking about an hour maybe about hour, hour and a half just to get through everything. But I know in the long run, it's going to be worth it. So I'm okay with doing it for now and utilizing it. Whee! Squeaky toys. <laughs> just think of them as squeaky toys. They're just little squeaky toys. 
They just have the cutest little squeak. Wait a minute, it just makes my look. Oh! <laughs> Alright, let's go there. Yee. Avoiding those little. Avoiding them, avoiding those. Avoiding them. Trying to avoid those green bug infestations. You don't want to get in there, I'll slow you down. Alright, we should have two more. Right here. Yay, we're done. Ooh, yay! Now we can move on. To our chief. Here we go. To the chief again. Alright. Oh good, he's up. Yay! We don't have to wait for him. Woohoo! Alright, and then we still have to burn the ropes again. Should be along this side. Looks like there's someone out here doing the quest. That's okay. We just gotta give it a few minutes to respawn again. Hey, maybe it's people who are watching this and being like, I can go do that. <laughs> Alright, probably have to get our shrimp dumplings again. Yep, we have to get the spicy shrimp dumplings again. So we gotta get those. Maybe one of these guys will have it? No. No. Yay, all done. All right, good. So now we're gonna go turn everything in. So we're heading back to that yellow diamond way over there. We're just gonna go back and talk to Farmer Yoon again. Turn in our dailies. See if there's anything else that we can do to open up anything else. Hello. There's that. And then we also get to turn in, oh nice, now we're revered. Awesome. So now we're gonna do witch berries again. May the mist and it looks like we're gonna go talk to Ella. Jade. Turn in that, burning the ropes, and turning in her gift as well. Mm -hmm. Alright, so she should have a gift for her. I thought I hit complete on that. Okay. There's her gift. Alright, so now we. If you are on another account and you don't have your bonus rep, go ahead and buy that from Gina right now. I can't use it, so I'm going to skip it. I've bought it on alts before. Unfortunately, learned that lesson the hard way. Where I had to um, spend the 42 gold and then like go, oh, I can't even use it on this alt. So um, it says, you can't utilize that. I was like, oh, bummer. Okay, so yeah, if you want to do that, go ahead and grab that from Gina. If this is your very first account, you're getting revered on this. Well, very first tune on this account. Um... All right, so now we're gonna grow the farm, the broken wagon. So now we gotta go to the lake and go to that NPC. She'll have you dive for some boards. All right. So right here. So she is right here. So if you came from Half Hill, just fly a little bit northwest. All right, so now we're gonna grow the farm. You need my help. And then we need to collect 100 wax planks and they're at the bottom of this lake over here. Now there are mobs in here, so be prepared for that. Be 
Yeah, you're just gonna pick these up. I think they come in oh, stacks of like 25, 17, 10, it's just random. Sometimes the mobs will aggro you, other times they won't. Looks like they're coming for me though. Trying to get this last one. The water is not letting me. <laughs> the water was fighting against me. Okay, so we're all done with those. I'm just gonna go up to the surface of the water here. Not that I'm gonna run out of breath or anything, but it's just quicker for me to go ahead and mount over and fly there. There we go. All right. Welcome. So now our third plot is gonna be opened. So now you're gonna go back to your farm and you're gonna have to just stand on the farm with the little buff that'll show up here, a 15 minute timer. And we will, yeah, that's another reason. We will open up this farm together. See, now here is fish. And she is already working on getting this plot open for us. And now you'll see right here growing the farm. She's currently upgrading us. Um, you have to stay on this farm. I just want me to chill out on the rock right here. And wait the 15 minutes. So I will uh, come back. We'll do this YouTube magic where I will be right back when it's all said and done. Alright. The 15 minutes is over. And we have our third plot of land. So let's go ahead and proceed from here. So now we're gonna go ahead and get our pest repeller. So we're gonna go back to the Half Hill Market and we're gonna call, we're gonna talk to Gina Mudclaw. Tell me of your travels. So go ahead and buy the pest repellers right here. And then we have to go turn that in back to Farmer Yoon. So here we go back here. So they'll get that installed on our farm right away. So now if you kind of just walk away from your farm, we're gonna get some snake root seeds, by the way. So let's go ahead and get about 20 of those. I don't think we can get the bag of them yet. Nope, but that's okay. We're gonna get our snake root and start getting some of that on this character. So I'm gonna go ahead and put that on. So basically these other carrots, witch berries, jade, squash, all that stuff was just filler until we can get to planting the snake root seeds for our daily black, white, trillium ore, which have a really high sell rate on my realm. Um, 35 gold for each one, roughly for the black, I believe. Um, I'll have to check my numbers again, but I'm pretty sure they're in the 30s for that. The Ghost Iron Ore has dropped somewhat in price. Um, but yeah, this beat to you having to go out and mine for it. If you don't want to mine for it, you can just passively grow it um, on your farm. And yeah, so that's what I do. So now we have, we don't have to use this anymore. So we can move that over there. I like to have my yak mount out too. So yeah, just don't mind me. Just rearranging my bars really quickly. So I really can't wait till we can get all four plots open because then we get the lovely the lovely plow that we won't have to do all these individually. <laughs> I'm going to be so happy. Um, I just opened the fourth plot on one of my other alts and I was so ecstatic. I was like, yeah, we get the plow. I can't wait to share that with all of my friends on YouTube and show them how we don't have to do each individual one. So yeah, it's gonna be nice when that happens. So we should probably be able to open this tomorrow. I'm hoping, if not tomorrow, it should be at least one more day. But I believe we'll be able to do this tomorrow so that we'll have our farm fully opened in a week's time, but we're still gonna be planting and getting our crops and so forth, so. I'm 
probably hop on my hunter after this, which is my main one. Um, or my mage. One of them has the on the ore. And I can walk you through really quick what your end result's going to be. Alright, so now that we have all these eight planted, I'd like to go ahead and hit this pest repeller. I'll take care of all those instead of us having to individually spray them. It'll take care of all eight plots and then water them. All right, same I do over here. And then we'll go back and do what needs to be done on each individual in a minute. All right, so now they're parched. So they're parched, but we're just going to go ahead and hit this and hit that. Not that I had any, but that's just kind of the habit that I get into. Alright, so let's go ahead and get the smothers. All the smothered ones. Oh, <laughs> that one button. Alright, is there any more smothers over here? We have a runty. Jump. Um, we have a wiggly one, which means we have a vermin. And then the tangled, I save for last. Tangled in the vines, I typically save for last. So that'll be it for today. That's it for today's video. And all of our, just double checking, everything says growing. I'm gonna go ahead and log myself out at the inn over here. I'm gonna hop on one of my other tunes really quick that has the full farm. Double check my prices. I know it's not the ghost iron, so. Oh, that's right, we keep having issues with that. Let's go on the mage. Yeah, the authentication servers for a while was having some issues today. So hopefully we can get back in. If not, I'll just end it here in a minute, but we will see. Looks like we might be okay. Fingers crossed. Yay, we're in. Good deal. Alright, so this character, like my, my three characters, my hunter, my paladin, my mage, and my warlock, all have the half hill farms all done. So all I do, this is what all you'll do. Once you get everything all set up, you're just going to log in every day. And all you're going to do is go through. See, here's our snake root, right? So you're just going to go ahead and harvest everything. So this is the the end result that we're aiming for with this little series slash tutorial that we're going through. So this is what it'll look like for you when we get it all said and done. Which will be so nice. Ooh, I need to buy snake root bags. All right, let's go buy the snake root really quick. Yeah, so the black trillium ore is 30 gold, and I get 12 of them every day on this character. And then, so once you have the full farm open, you'll get about 12 to 14 of these, but yeah, 12 there. 16 ghost iron ore, which is not that expensive right now for me. Um, but the white trillium ore and the black trillium ore is where you're going to get most of your gold from passively. And if you have more than just one character, right, you're definitely going to be making um, some gold there. So I do this on like right now, at least four. Um, and then I have all the other ones. I got four more. So I'm gonna have eight by the time I'm done. So, and once I start doing this, it'll just be a daily thing. And it'll take like five or 10 minutes on each ult. So it won't take too much longer, but I'm just gonna show you what my daily routine looks like once you get everything opened up. And then this is what I can't wait for. The plow. And we went a little crooked. <laughs> and we went a little crooked. But it wouldn't have done it anyway because of that. So if it's occupied with a vermin, it's not going to do it anyway. So plow is nice. And we'll get this right after we open up the fourth plot. So 
That'll be great. I can't wait to be able to use that on all of my other ones. So, yep, I go through and plow them all. And we have a little vermin. And then, yeah, you do have to till it after that, but that's okay. So then we're going to go ahead and plant our snake roots. So it's nice when you get the bag. Again, you're not going to have to individually do it. You might think when we're going through the tutorial, like, oh my goodness, I'm going to have to do each individual seed and each individual thing. No, it, it, you can see right here, it gets really easy. So I plant them all, and then I run through and do all of the little propeller things. And the water. Capture any more allurings. All right, so we have some runties. We're gonna get the wiggling ones. Um, there's a runty here. Do I have any other wiggling ones? I have another wiggling one right here. So I kind of do alluring and wiggling together so you can just kill them all in one shot. Or so I think. All right, so we got tangled, tangled, runty. I like to do runty and wiggling first. So I kind of just check. Okay, so then I move to the smothering weeds. And like I said, I save the tangled and the vines for last. Yeah, see, that didn't take very long. We'll be done in no time. And then I'll come back and I'll do the same thing tomorrow on the same character. Didn't take long at all, right? So I hope you're excited. Hope you see what we're doing. And uh, this will be very nice. Once you get it, it'll be passive income every day. Remember, wild tokens, if that's what your goal is or what you're saving up for, you only need about 4,000 gold right now per day to make a wild token in a month. You can easily do that with your garrison and your half hill farms and then just a little bit of leveling and world quests that you're doing in Shadowlands right now. You can definitely get it pretty easy. So what other kind of series would you guys like to see here on the channel? We went through the garrison. We went through the half hill farm, which will be done within a day or so. Um, leave a comment below. Let me know what you'd like to see next. Um, if not, I'm just going to keep on going through um, maybe some other ways I make gold in the game. All right, so let's go ahead and post these. So yeah, if you'd like to see anything else, um, leave a suggestion in the comments and I'll see what I can do about making sure we can show that. So yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching. Sorry the video was delayed, but hopefully it didn't delay you in opening up uh, your third plot on your farm. I will see you guys again tomorrow. Have a good one. Thanks for watching. Oh, also, if you're enjoying this series and you're enjoying the videos I'm putting out on my YouTube channel um, this year in 2021, I would like to grow my channel even more, get more subscribers, get some more likes on some videos. So if you're enjoying it and you're just currently watching but you like my content, Please don't forget to hit that subscribe button, it's free, and go ahead and hit a like on this video. Thank you so much for watching. Have a good day, everybody. Bye!